Hi, I'm Chris Shattuck with buildamodule.com, and in this video we're going to talk about Drupal JavaScript behaviors. So we're going to cover what behaviors do, first of all, then we're going to look at a few examples, and uh, we'll recap the process step by step so you can see uh, a little outline of what goes on during the process. And finally, I'll show you some helpful links so you can learn a little bit more about JavaScript behaviors. Behaviors solve a really big problem, which is how do you attach JavaScript events to dynamic content? So by JavaScript events, I mean things like clicking on something or dragging something or uh, hovering over something. All of those things can trigger JavaScript actions. And so when we create new content, JavaScript doesn't run automatically on that new content. So you'll, you'll see in the examples what I mean by that. First of all, let's identify where dynamic content can come from. It can come from two places. First of all, it can come from Ajax. So Ajax is a way of fetching content from the server without re refreshing the page. So when we load something via Ajax, that gets added to the page but there's no JavaScript that's been run on that content, so we have to run it on that content explicitly. Also, we can create content dynamically with just JavaScript without making any server calls, so occasionally that will happen, and that's the example that I'm going to show you next. Let's go ahead and take a look at a couple of examples. First of all, I want to show you a custom one I put together just to uh, identify the, the core techniques that you'll need to use in order to employ behaviors. So what I've done is included this content in a module called glue which I use for just hodgepodge stuff in my in my Drupal install that don't doesn't quite fit inside of another module and what I've done is added a JavaScript file in my init hook. If you're not sure about how to add JavaScript uh, go ahead and take a look at my adding CSS and JavaScript video on buildamodule.com. And then here is the entirety of the JavaScript file that we're working with. Thank you for watching this preview from buildamodule.com. On our website, we offer a number of free videos, as well as several others that are available for a reasonable price. Come check us out!